For mission two, you want to move down to the pink section. The pink section allows you to control the driving motors both at the same time. First thing you want to do is set your movement motors. The default for the EV3 is port B and port C. So if you forget to attach this block, it automatically uses port B and C. So a general rule of thumb to make it easier for yourself is to plug your two driving motors into port B and port C. That way you can leave that block out and make your programming look a little bit cleaner. All right, so there's a couple of ways to do this. You can do it separately. I could choose the speed first, which is 40%, and then the drive forward for 500 degrees. Another way is to do all those things in one block. So if I go down to this block, I move straight for 500 degrees at 40% speed. Two ways to do the same thing. Now for the advanced, it's very similar. Program your robot to move forward for three rotations. So if I change that to rotations and go three, leave it at 40%, and then backwards, there's a couple of options you could use. One is to duplicate the same block, right click, duplicate it. And if I wanna go backwards for two seconds, I can either set it to two, two seconds and just change the speed to negative, meaning the wheels will spin the other way, which is backwards. The other option is if you did it separately, you set the speed at the start to 40, and then you can just use the top blocks where the speed isn't needed, just the direction. So forward for three rotations and then backwards for two seconds, both achieving the mission.